How about you? Welcome to Hamiltonville Farm. Today we're going to teach Gina how to drive the Mahindra 4540. Stick around. Uh, subscriber Mark McCoy suggested that we do a video on how to teach Gina to drive the tractor. And we thought, man, that's a great idea. So today we're going to do that. We hope, we hope that's a great idea. So, uh, Mark, if she wrecks it, I'm sending you a bill for the tractor. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, anyway, so we're going to teach her the fundamentals on how to drive a tractor. And you should see, you know, we'll go, to, I'll teach her the process of how to use the clutch, change the gears. This is a gear driven tractor. And uh, it's, so if you have a hydrostatic or a shuttle shift, it'll be just a, a tick difference. And so I'll teach her how to use the clutch. I'll teach her how to use the bucket. And we'll probably even hook up a box blade or so. All right, so let's get started with the instructions. All right, what you want to do first is you want to turn the key on one click. So go ahead and turn the key on. And what you're going to see up here is a picture. This red, this red icon is your glow plugs. That glow plugs, it helps get the engine warmed up, kind of less, for simple terms, it helps get the engine warmed up before you crank it. Okay. All right. You're talking and, about this right there. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going to wait till that, that goes off. But in the meantime, this tractor is equipped with a neutral safety switch. And so the tractor won't crank if it's not in neutral. So this is your low high indicator here. And in between it is, a, is the neutral position. So go ahead and push back and forth and see if you can feel that click. Feel the notch? Right there. Yeah. All right, so that's neutral. Then your shifter is just like any standard car shifter. This particular tractor has eight forward gears and two reverse gears, but we're not going to get all, in, you're not going to be in high speed gear eight, all right? Why not? <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, so whenever we get ready, this is your clutch. You depress the, or you don't have to depress the clutch to start it because you're in the neutral. You never want to be in front of the tire when you're cranking the tractor, just in case. Uh, so I'm going to let you go ahead and turn the key over. Uh, oh, this is your throttle. Okay. To go up decreases the RPMs of the engine and to go down increases the RPMs. All right. So make it go faster. All right. So when you crank it up, if the engine is idling too low or too high, you can adjust it with this lever here. All right. Make sure it's on uh, neutral and I'll step out of the way here. Okay. This is the clutch. You don't need to clutch on. You don't have to press the clutch on when it's uh, in neutral here. Break. Yeah. Okay, so now let's demonstrate. Let me show you how you can feel the controls for the hand throttle, okay? So go ahead and move the hand throttle up and down and here you can hear the RPMs. Here it go down. Yeah. All right, good job. This is that joystick that controls the bucket up, down, open and close, or up, down, tilt forward and tilt back. All right, if I do like this, that means the bucket goes up. If I do like this, that means the bucket goes down. If I do like this, it's uh, tilt up and down, all right? Now, if we want to raise and lower our implements on the back, then we use this lever here. And on the, go, see how the words lift and lower are located there? So if you want to raise your attachment that's on the back of your tractor, you push it toward the lift position. And if you want to lower it closer to the ground, you obviously, you lower it, all right? So we'll, we'll talk more about that whenever we put the box blade on, okay? this point it's just like a car a stick shift car so you push a clutch in you put it you put it low and put it in first gear and you're gonna crawl because low actually you can go ahead and put it in second gear put it in low there you go let me step out of the way second gear good job raising the bucket
Like for your box blade work, so we'll teach you how to do the box blade. Um, you're gonna start with the, the blade just slightly above the ground and whatever you wanna pull, you're just gonna, you're gonna pull that pile of debris or dirt or whatever. And then as you slowly go forward, you're gonna take your right hand and you're gonna uh, manipulate that lever on the, the black knob there, the lower and lift lever. Uh, and that will bring, that will raise that box blade ever so slightly if you do it slow and that will release that dirt from underneath it and that's how you kind of and so you, do you start with it all the way on the ground you can start with it just slightly above the ground maybe maybe a half inch okay all right let's try it let's try it You liked it? Yeah. All right, cool. You know, there's a, you know, this is obviously a, uh, 
beginner driver's course she is uh, a lot more capable to go to the next level but uh, <laughs> if you're teaching someone how to drive a tractor number one important most important thing is safety and there's a lot to think about right a lot of moving parts a lot of moving a lot parts of so think about your, where your front of the tractor how long the tractor is you know the tractor is a beast of a piece of equipment and so just be cognizant of where it's at at all times or the front and the back and your turning radius and things like that i think the hardest part for me was when we were trying to go up the hill, not rolling backwards, controlling the clutch yeah. while thinking about the bucket. And right, right. So I need yeah. practice, obviously. Well, you did great. I think you did a wonderful <laughs> job. As a matter of fact, you did so good. I think uh, I'm going to leave you the truck. finish? <laughs> I need you to finish that pile up there. <laughs> I'll go bake cookies and you go run the farm equipment. <laughs> so, hey, listen, there's going to be a picture of the barn pop up here in just a sec. We'd love for you to click on that and hit the subscribe button. Thanks, Mark, for making the suggestion for uh, this video. Yeah, uh, great idea. yeah, it was a great idea. So we're. Hey, I think we need to have another video of teaching Hank how to do something. Uh -oh. Don't you think? Uh oh. Yeah, uh -oh. Like maybe something inside, or I don't know, maybe picking up his laundry. Uh <laughs> That'd be a great idea. Yeah. If you think I should have a video of me picking to up my laundry, that's not. People laundry. don't want to see my laundry. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, listen, we appreciate you. That picture should be popped up by now. We'd love for you to hit the subscribe button, give us a big thumbs up, and uh, thanks we'll for watching. Yeah, thanks for watching, it and was we'll fun. yeah, we'll see you on the next video. Y'all take care. <laughs>